Hey everyone, so right before I get straight into the video and everything, I know I have been doing a lot of videos, um, like, at this angle and stuff, like, in my room, and, um, I know that, like, it's sort of, like, I feel like I, it's looking, all my videos are looking the same, um, but I'm actually, so, sorry if, like, this isn't really working for you, I'm actually probably going to be, um, going into a room with, like, better lighting, because, like, this is just not good. Like, my house doesn't have, like, the best lighting for my videos and stuff. I want to get, like, a lighting set. I just don't really know yet. And then, uh, I want to, like, find a different place. So, hopefully not too many video more videos will just be, like, in the same spot. But, um, anyways, let's just go ahead and get on into the video now. Um, so this is going to be, uh, treats that you can give your hermit crabs that's safe for them. Because... Uh, this video, like, I feel like there's, really there isn't a lot of stuff that people know about hermit crabs. Like, there's not really any 100% accurate way to, like, tell their, their exact age. And there's not, like, um, they really don't know, like, everything they need for their diet. Like, to keep them, like, you know, like, for gerbils and hamsters and stuff, you know, like, you know, like, the exact amounts of, like, food to give them and everything, but for hermit crabs, it's really different, like, you'll hear different theories and stuff, but nothing has really actually been proved, sorry, my gerbil's, like, climbing onto the lid of her cage, anyway, um, anyways, so, I'm just going to go ahead and make this video about treats I give my hermit crabs, because this is a question I get a lot, this is a question that I get asked a lot, so I decided to finally make this video, and let's go ahead and start. Okay, so the first thing is um, baby puffs. Um, if you don't know what they are, it'll I think they're literally just called baby puffs. They're like just little like they sort of look like little cereal things. You can find them just like at Walmart, Target. Uh, they have only have like one gram of sugar, and they're super good. My um, I even like to eat them sometimes. My uh, hermit crabs really like those. I'll usually just give them one or two, and you can also give that to your gerbils. It's just like a bonus thing I give to her, um, but I usually don't give them to her that much because, I mean, that is sort of more than I usually give her for treats and everything. And so that is one thing, and I'm just saying that first because I don't actually have, like, any with, like, like, we don't have any in our pantry or anything right now, so I'm just gonna... Yeah, and then let's just go on to the next thing. <laughs> okay, so the next thing is going is Cheerios. Um, my hermit crabs also really like Cheerios. I'll I'll usually just scatter like three. I'll probably just put like around three in their cage or so, and then they'll all just sort of you know pick on it a little bit. I mean, they really don't eat like a whole bunch at one time. And yeah, so that's one uh, another one thing I like to give them. And another thing they super they love popcorn we don't have any meat so i'm just showing you the kernels right now um yeah but make sure it cannot have salt or butter or anything just like plain popcorn before you put on the butter don't get like pre-buttered popcorn or whatever i think that's the thing i'm pretty sure but <laughs> um yeah so mine really like like i'll probably yeah i usually do like three pieces of popcorn too and i'll just plain popcorn i'll just put those in their cage and they really like to eat those and then they'll eat like all of it um so, just make sure, I guess, like, there's no kernels, you know, left or anything, because, you know, they don't eat those and stuff. But, um, yeah, so I like to give them popcorn. And then, they actually, my hermit crabs actually like dates. I'll just, I think I showed these in, like, my hermit crab nutrition, like, what I feed my hermit crabs. Like, I didn't actually, I just did, like, the regular things I feed them. I didn't actually, like, have um, treats in that video, so I can link that down below, but, uh, I actually, they actually really like dates, and I will just cut them up, and, um, yeah, so, they, I'll, and then I'll just put those in there, and they like to eat those, and then, um, this is a bad example, um, they like cashews, just not, no salt, like, make sure it's just, like, a plain, like, unsalted nuts, basically, uh, it doesn't even just have to be cashews, I, I think I've done almonds before, I'm pretty sure, uh, I just don't do them a whole bunch, but yeah, so they really like, like, unsalted nuts, they all like to eat those, um, but some of my hermit crabs do eat different stuff, some do eat things that the others eat, but some, you know, just that kind of thing, um, I have also, like, you know, I don't have any of this with me either, but, uh, baby food, um, some people like to do baby food for theirs, so they'll kind of just take a little spoon, 
or like a small part of it and just sort of put it in there and uh, I've done that before too and my hermit crabs really enjoy that too so you can also do baby food but yeah once again I don't have any with me right like right this second and yeah so they also yeah that's another option you can do um, and probably the biggest thing that my hermit crabs love to eat so much like it's a like I just count it as a treat I mean I think that a lot of people will just put that in there like with their regular diet but mine just love it so much so I am going to add it into this video and it is apples just like apple slices um I usually don't like put in like even this big of one I'll usually just um I used to before my guinea pig died uh, I would just take one of the apples and I just like split it in half and I give like this part to my hermit crabs and then this part to my guinea pig or sometimes I'd even since you know even though hermit crabs they love it so much they usually don't even eat the whole thing because they're just so tiny um but I'd even like cut this just like this teeny tiny thing in half and or like well maybe not in half like just like that much and I give it to my gerbil because I know this is like a lot like like even that little bit is a little bit more for your gerbil and everything um but she loves them too so all my animals except like my fish and you know that kind of stuff obviously um love apples so that works really well like if we have like an extra like just um some extra apples or whatever because they'll all just eat those and everything so because sometimes like my little sister you know she'll like ask for an apple but she won't eat it all so then I can just you know cut it up and give it to my animals and I'm actually going to give it to them right now because they love it so much and we have some extra ones like these extra pieces right now and so they'll they really enjoy those so um yeah uh, if you have like any other questions about like treats to give your hermit crabs um I I'm sure like I there's some I may have forgotten and didn't list in this video and so if you have any more you know that you want to know like if you should if you can give them to your hermit crabs or not you can just